Lovely. Right, so we're going to start with effleurage. And it's up to you which way round, whether you want to work the other side so you can see what I'm doing. Yeah, that Rather than your back yeah. to me. And we'll sort the shoulders out a bit. Just clip that one. So I can be a little bit firm. Mm. Do you like firm pressure? <laughs> you tell me. Not it's too much. much. Yes, do. Give me plenty yeah. of feedback. Well, yes, I don't like it as firm as Roy does. No, that's fine. I think it's more of him. <laughs> what kind of pressure do you like, Roy? Yeah, it's quite firm. It's quite firm. Yeah. Yeah. I'm more of a medium pressure girl. <laughs> okay. He's the that's all right, I quite like that. It <laughs> doesn't kill my thumbs quite so much. How's that pressure? Yeah, that's, that's lovely. So I think the main thing with sports massage is not to choose too much of an area to cover. Yeah. You know, so that... Um, I'm just trying to copy your, how are you doing that? It's like backwards. It is, it's like... Yeah, just let your hands do it, okay. rather than your head. If you think about it too much, you sort of wrap your fingers around each other. <laughs> just let your fingers do the walking. That's oh, it. It's really warming. Yeah, well, it's just a How form of effleurage. Yeah, just... And then we can go into a figure of eight. Just get a little yeah. deeper. You can feel a few knots there. Yeah. More knots than the girl should have in her back, I think. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, there's a few lactic acid crystals there crunching around these <laughs> shoulders. Have you had any chiropractic or osteopathic? I have, treatments? but not recently. No, I can feel it in your back there. It's funny. Can you? It's always a rigidity. Really? With, yeah, with people who've had manipulations. Gosh, I have always had, though, I'm, I'm very inflexible in my spine. Right. I always have been. Yeah, it feels there's mm. certainly a rigidity mm. there. Let's go the other way and pull back on these shoulders. How's the pressure for you? Yeah, a little bit, a no. tiny bit hard. Okay. Worse, that's better. better than yeah. getting in that right shoulder. This bit just here, yeah. yeah and, I can well, feel and it. down a little bit further there. And down and this way? Yeah. That there and across to my spine. It feels like a sort of reversed L shape. Like that? Down to there and then across, yeah. Across this way? Across to, towards the centre of my back, like that. Yeah. Ah, okay. So it sort of starts in the middle, works to the shoulder and goes up to the neck. <laughs> yeah. That's how it feels anyway. <laughs> But that's, yeah, that's tender as well. So I'm going to go straight in for some kneading. Yeah, that's a bit, that's a bit tender, I think. Yeah, is that still too much? A little, little bit. That pressure for you? No, I just think it's a bit tender there from Wednesday. A bit firmer? A little bit more. Yeah. Yeah, yeah no, that's fine. That's great. Good. I can do quite well. Oh, okay. <laughs> just building the strength back up my arms. My hands. Oh yeah, that's very, that's totally tender in there. Is that better? Yeah, lovely. I mean, it's, I can, it's not, it's hurting a little bit, but I think, you know, it's, it's, I used to play a lot of it's not, yeah, yeah. 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 it's oh, always like that, that children, I used to do a lot, I used to be a PE teacher, what right. one, oh, one of my row. previous jobs, oh, yeah, so. <laughs> and, um, sort of thing. did a lot yeah. of so racket this, sports, this yeah, yeah, that's it, okay. I have had, but, in the past, I've had cortisone injections as well, it's been <laughs> have you? Had real cortisone, wow. but so where did you go in the future? Oh, yeah. um, in the, I used to play, but I was in the back row, so. front, yeah. in the front, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. I was in the outside centre and uh, fly half. Oh, brilliant, yeah. Yeah. So, who did you play for? I don't, um, have, the, I don't have the same sort of problems as I used to have with it. Oh, yeah, I know. Yeah, who did you play for? Oh, gosh, loads of teams. Uh, Worcester, Worcester. That's feeling a bit easier, does it? Yeah, feel easier? Worcester, yeah, Worcester and then Worcestershire and Herefordshire. Oh, cool. And West Midlands. Oh, brilliant. My housemate will love that. She's um, 
her dad really into his rugby and they're from Worcester. Oh really? Yeah. Oh gosh. He had an England trial, he's not going to tell you that bit. <laughs> oh wow. <laughs> I didn't get in though. Awesome. <laughs> well he still, you know, he still yeah. considers you. Good. I was a possible lot of problems. Lots of effleurage, lots of frictions around the shoulders. That's lovely actually. It feels John nice. Kendall Carpenter, apparently his granddaughter's, well great granddaughter, sorry. It's She's one of her friends down in Yuki now, but also he was, I went to Wellington and he was the headmaster there. Oh, right. So he set up the Rugby World Cup. Oh. Yeah. I think he was actually at school, uh, teaching at the school when he was doing it. Yeah, I just learned that new thing recently. Oh. But it's changed so much since I played. I mean, it was all amateur in my day, so things have become very much more serious yeah. with the professional game. Yeah, it's really fun. Well, financially serious, but I always think they mess about a lot. They? <laughs> <laughs> they're, like, they're like actors, really. Mm. I actually had a sports massage off a guy who used to be... That's a bit down there that you're doing. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That, was, that, that was an yes. ouchie hour. Yeah. <laughs> but very good. Yeah. Serrated Santeria. That's, that's quite tender just mm. there. Where just you here? Are. Yeah. Oh, okay. A bit too much pressure. <laughs> no, no, okay. It's a cross between hurting a bit and tickling. <laughs> yeah, it's a yeah. bit of an unusual yeah. place. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. I think both of us have got uh, kind of injuries from the past. Because, you know, Denise, you were involved in sport a lot, weren't you? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. What did you play? Well, I, I, well, I played netball and I played tennis at yeah. sort of county level, but oh, I taught PE, so... Oh, brilliant. Yeah. Where did you teach? I, in Exeter, I taught at um, Priory okay. and Vincent Thompson and St cool. Margaret's workshop. Oh, nice. <laughs> um, yeah, that was all. Cool. Right, so okay, we do quite sore down there. Yeah, frictions, yeah. you get your yeah. analgesia. Yeah. Gosh, that feels crunchy. Yep, it's <laughs> very crunchy. Have you got tickets for the Rugby World Cup then? No, no, we, uh, we're not going to go to it. I just, funny enough, I don't actually, I don't enjoy watching it as much as I used to. I do. No. I do watch it, but not, not, not fanatically. Yeah. I think there's a real difference when you stop playing something. It just doesn't seem to, somehow, to me, you didn't have the same feel about it. Oh. Yeah, I guess you're not as connected. Yeah. I was in Australia, travelling up through Australia in 2003 or four, when they did the Rugby World Cup. Oh, 2003, Cup. yeah. Yeah, in Australia. And we were there in Maloolaba watching wow. it. And then we were up in Port Douglas yeah, when the final right. was on, oh, right. and we were the only two English people oh, in this yeah. right. Oh my goodness! They were ever such good losers there. They brought <laughs> strengths. It really? was really, yeah. That's very sweet. Yeah, yeah I wasn't really in too into rugby, but um, I've got one of the little rugby bears and oh. um, a scarf from it. That's fun. Yeah, it was good. Yeah, it's a great atmosphere. I was in New Zealand last for the last one in two thousand and eleven. Mm. Oh, New Zealand, yeah, yeah, that was really fun. A lot of competition between the Kiwis and the Australians. Yeah, when well, New Zealand won, the whole country went mad. But it was really fun. There's such a good atmosphere, such a nice crowd. So you could do a soft tissue release on the supraspinatus. I'm just going to grab you. Okay. okay. So with the supraspinatus, to put it into um, traction, it has to come out here. Okay. All right. Um, if it comes too far, then it's the deltoid that kicks in. Okay. So we want it just about there. So if you relax your arm, and no, I'm going to apply the pressure, yeah. and then take it in and out again. Okay. So apply pressure in and out. Oh, okay. How's that feeling? Mm -hmm. Okay. Just I might do a few thing. rows of that. Okay. So it's like Gail. Yeah. It's like that. So if I look in there. Yeah. And then I would use the whole half whole of your hand. Okay. Like that. Like that. Yeah. And then come out. So not too far, because it's a supermarket bag. And then in. 
and back. And then we that's it. Yeah. And then go all the way up as far as the neck. So you're coming out, in, then back, move, stir up, say lock. And that's a good soft tissue release for the supraspinatus, the yeah, upper trapezius. Okay. That's not the same as the one where you have it there and then he pushes out to um, push against your leg. That's a, that. Well, that would be a PNF. That's a resisted stretch. But it's oh, so not soft tissue. No, soft okay. tissue is. You you can have soft and tissue with a counter strain. Yeah, so if you go through that, so you push against the leg and then relax and then you go... Don't do that for the Yartek examiners anymore. They don't understand it. They don't do counter strain. Don't know what it is. Okay. And we started being told that um, our students didn't know how to do soft tissue release because they were having restrictive movements. Oh, right. And that is something that I learnt yeah. in the Northern Institute, so we had to take it out. Oh, right, okay. So we have to make sure that... It's be, like, visible. Yeah, sort of, it's fine to do in your own clinic a soft yeah. tissue release with a counter strain, but it tends to be a, a sort of an amalgamation of two <coughs> treatments rolled okay. into one. All right. So, um, yeah, that would be more of a stretch, though. That would be a resistive stretch. Okay. All right. So, this, see, so it would be a soft tissue release if you've got your client to push towards you while you isolated up here. So if you push towards my hand, that's so it. So coming out in that way. Relax. Lovely and relax. And, push and again, push and relax. and relax. Push and relax. Push and relax. Which did you feel was the most effective, first or second? Um, probably, I don't know. <laughs> I'm not sure. Similar, similar I'd right, say. Similar. Yeah, hard to tell. Yeah. So it's really your preference, mm, to yeah. be honest. I think that's just. I'm sure that's how, well maybe that was is there something else where you push against? Well there is a P and F stretch. Yeah. So you don't lock for that. Okay, so, yeah. And then you check. <laughs> yeah. So it's um that's a P and F stretch, it's when you want to relax the muscle and, and lengthen it. Yeah. Okay. You would get your client then to push against you. <laughs> but um on some areas you can see the benefit and this area you can Yeah. Not unless it was a really bad restriction. Yeah. Okay. All right? Cool. So then you might do some pressure points okay, or even much. some soft tissue release. So, so you hold um, and you maybe come over at the top with the thumb. Okay. Is that right? It's not too much. Fine. Fine. So you put quite a lot of pressure? pressure on here like you lock in well it's actually just taking because it, it's not really a lock because it's um lymph drainage you don't want to be too firm for lymph okay. drainage because that's just under the skin so, so that's is that's that's not the same soft tissue really no this is connective tissue Con oh connective tissue sorry so connective tissue is going to just get rid of any fluid in the lymph drainage underneath the skin And then the tissues. And you just take up the slack with one hand. Yeah. That's it. So just watch your posture when you're doing it. Yeah, I'm just going to wear yourself <laughs> out. Try and relax okay. your shoulders yeah. and just isolate the area. So you might find a few trigger points now. Anything here? Mm, yes, there. <laughs> no. Take a deep breath in and breathe out slowly. Just let me know when it starts to ease off a bit. Okay. Do you think there's a point about that? Um, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's easy. Just hang on to it till it's gone all together. Is it going? Yeah. Yeah. yeah? 
Okay, so you keep holding it until it's... Yes, yeah, so I think I think the biggest <coughs> mistake is that you take it off too quickly. <coughs> yeah. You know, and especially if it's an acute problem, it'll go really quickly. Yeah. If it's a chronic problem, you'll be lucky if you do clear it in one session. Yeah. The chronic ones tend have been there a long time, so they take a little bit longer to yeah. clear. Yeah. It's more acute and it's only been there a short period of time then it's much more likely to clear quickly. Yeah, I've done things where they, like, it goes down a bit, and it's like breaking down a wall, like, and they go yes. like, after treatment, after treatment, it gets smaller, so... Yeah. Yeah. Okay. All right, so, so I'm you, just going to... So you don't... Because I think for this one, we, like, did all the... So again, yeah, that's a, that is a trigger point with a counter strain. So... And that means that it's going to be a lot deeper. I wouldn't move a limb with a trigger point. Oh, no, until that, was, that was for for like testing. So this is just what I remember from the, and I've got from the notes. It's like we went down like that, like checking for trigger points. Oh, right. And then once we found one, so here, then. Oh, you know what just goes out of your head? I've already done this. Like, thank you. So did Derek oh, teach yeah. you? Oh, breath in, and then you pull up, you raise it. Um, so if you take a deep breath in and then raise it up, and then focus. and that is going to be a more severe trigger point for your client. Okay. So what you need to know is: is the normal trigger point just a bog standard trigger point? Okay. Is that going to be sufficient? Okay. If you're not making any headway, then put in a counter strain with it. Oh. Okay. But if, do you see what I mean? Yeah. Otherwise, that yeah, can be really, really intense on somebody who is already quite tender. Yeah. So I would say, normal take a normal stuff. stretch. So take your muscles, which yeah. are here, because I can feel knots. Can you, yeah. around yeah. here? Yeah. So take your ordinary muscle, yeah. and just go up with a nice palpation, yeah. all the way through, and then, is that one there? Yes. Yeah. You see there, if I trigger point that, yeah. Yeah. and the client can't feel anything, mm -hmm. I might then actually get the shoulder involved, get the okay. arm involved as a so you literally just press. They yeah. take a deep breath in, slowly out, deep, yeah. apply pressure until it eases. Yeah. Okay. All right, and they breathe through it and let yeah. them know if it's coming down and then if it's gone. Okay. And you can just do one or do you do up to like three on that point? It's entirely, if it goes completely and yeah. when you massage it, it's gone, yeah. you don't need to do it again. No. You might move on to another one, but if it's still there, you might do it a couple of times. Yeah, because I think we, it, it was like, just do it like, count to ten and then... But some but like I leave it a bit longer because then it is you know, usually is easing up in sort of 13, 14 seconds. So. Yeah. Yeah. But okay, so you just do. All right, so you're going so to just press. Take, here. Uh, where's the point? take a deep breath in and out. Just there. Just there. Yeah. That, thank you. Is that the right spot? Let's take a deep yeah. breath in. Let and me know if it out. eases off. What sort of number would it be pain wise? Oh, that one's not too bad. It's not too bad at all, no. okay. How does that four. feel out of ten? About a four. Out of ten, that's about seven. Okay. You feel it shift then? Mm. Just keep breathing through it. Yeah, it's easy. Yeah. Let me know if it goes completely. Yeah, it's very hard, isn't it, to gauge what when it's gone, or because you can still feel the pressure. Yes. Well, if it's <laughs> just <laughs> pressure, I think it's I'm just pressure. So okay. It's hard to tell whether it's the pressure or the pain. <laughs> no. so that's pain. when I would say it's gone. Okay. okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. If it's just pressure. Any more? Yeah. That's fine. Okay, great. Mm. Here? Yeah, around there somewhere. Okay. Well, it's another point there. That one? That's yep. it. Yeah. Deep breathe in. in. And out. Yes, it's quite a sharp pain. Is it easing off? Uh, not yet. Not yet. That's easy. Would you then release the pressure? Do you know when it's gone? No, it's going. See so also, you need to think about the direction of your thumbs, you know, it's the direction that you push your thumbs makes a difference yeah. to the muscle as well. So, you push kind so of these I'm going down on, but so when it comes to the top of here, I'm going that push, way. You're pushing which way? That, that way, towards but the yeah, toes. Push towards That's yeah. a painful way you're pushing. So I might even sit down, yeah. so I'm on the same level. Yeah. And then I'm going to work along the yeah. upper trapezius. Yeah. 
and come in here. Mm. It's up tender. Mm. So you went up, moved onto the traps? Yeah, I'm up the traps and super spinatus underneath. Okay, let's do this point. Yeah, Deep come on. And slowly up. Yes, it's just gone. Mm -hmm. Is it gone? Yeah, yeah. yeah, I felt that. Go, did, did you? Yeah. Just suddenly. <coughs> Excuse me. It's just about gone. What about that one? Yes, I will. <laughs> just, just feel it like it, it's, it goes. And also, if you get your client to focus, deep breathe on that area, sometimes yeah. they can isolate and relax a muscle individually. Really? Yeah, if you practice. So breathe in. I used to do that for, yeah, for free diving. Just and out. Oh, I just slipped off it, I think. Come down here. Is it there? That's it. Where's that? Yes. Yeah, it's easy, isn't it? Is there that in there? Mm -hmm. Oh. Uh, oh. That's okay. There's something in there, isn't there? Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> that's all right. Yeah, I just felt the lump. There's certainly something round there. 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 That. Uh, and there. In there? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, let's deep breath in. Slowly out. And oh, so you don't push up. And push up into the shoulder. <laughs> well, again, you could, but only if you want it to be deeper. Yeah. Sometimes, you know, with clients, it's deep enough. Yeah. Without you putting on that extra pressure. Yeah. That kills them. So, you know, if, you, if you've already got a sort of seven that you're working on, you wouldn't want to put that extra pressure on and bring it up to a ten or an eleven. Yeah, no. So you only do that. You've got that up your sleeve if you need it. Yeah. Okay. How's that one? Yeah, that Still there or not? Because yeah. all the trigger points we did mm. were, it was always with the contraction. Yeah, yeah, I know. It's probably how we, because you had to nail that first. Because I've been on the receiving end of a treatment, and I know that sometimes I don't want to make it any firmer. Yeah. How's that um, one? What number is that one? That's seven. Yeah. Yeah. Seven. Yeah. Deep breath in. You can do some very deep breaths in this one. Maybe an eight. Yeah. <laughs> really? Do you want me to ease up a bit? No, sorry. How's that been? It's not as painful as I thought it was going to be. It's about a five, I would say. Oh. Yep. Breathing through. Go? That's going, yeah. Still there, this one. Mm. Yeah, it's been there a while, I think. This one. Yeah. It's drawing a pension, this, yeah. this nod. That's that? yeah. easy. Is that okay? Yeah, just there. That's yeah. it. This way. Yeah. Deep yeah. breath in. Slowly out. Mm. There? Yes. Yeah. Exactly. Breathe yes. in. And out. And deep breaths. Let's focus on the air. But I think that yeah, when you do your treatments, just let your intuition take over. Yeah. Rather than get so bogged down with what was it we had to do? Because yeah. I think you do know what you have to do. Yeah. Just don't overthink it. Yeah. I, I do find just that my hands do it and then I just move around. Yeah. And I'm like, oh yeah. I mean, yeah. Like that's that's the way to do it. How's that feeling? Mm. How's that easier? That feels okay. Okay. I think we might be cooked this side. <laughs> <laughs> we might have to just knead it out and effleurage it out a little bit. Okay. Feeling a little bit nicer? Yep. Great. Okay. Let's Still a few there, aren't there? Yeah. Oh. You could be doing this yeah, forever, we could I think. Be there, <laughs> Let's have a go on the other okay. side. Not really. Yeah, the other side's not that bad. Better, I don't think. Easy. Mind you, um, on Wednesday she said it felt. Yeah, that's Are you warm enough? Yeah, I'm fine. Your skin just yeah. feels a bit. Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm, always, I'm always cold compared to Roy. He's always the warm blooded creature, and I'm not. That's why I drag him to warm countries. 
do have a lovely tan. <laughs> yes, I don't think even at my best I would be anywhere near that. <laughs> um, it's not very healthy, is it, now being brown? Not meant to be no. brown. But it does make you feel good. Yes, I know. <laughs> It just feels as though sunshine recharges my batteries a bit. It does, yeah. doesn't it? Absolutely. Yeah, I just moved back from 10 months in LA. Oh, <laughs> lovely. And it's cloudy, I'm like, <laughs> a bit confused. It's not somewhere we've ever been. Uh, oh, I've, I've been, been to LA. LA. I went yeah. to... Uh, Definitely. Nice. Hollywood and Universal yeah. Studios. I was living in Hollywood. Brilliant. Yeah, two blocks from Capitol Records. And I took wow. a photograph of a down and out <laughs> well, lots of in Beverly things. Hills. There was a chap sat in a, in a knackered armchair on the street, really? asleep with headphones in, <laughs> on the pavement. In. So how long did you say you were out there for? Uh, ten months. Oh, wow. Yeah. Lovely. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. I was on Venice Beach for the first two months and then I went to music school in Hollywood. Oh yeah. Did you? Yeah. Very good. I'm a music producer now, Gail. Huh? <laughs> I'm a music producer now. Oh, really? Yeah. Wow. Yeah. I've got a friend who's a music composer oh, cool. called Computer Games. Oh, awesome. He lives yeah. locally. Oh, does? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Me. That's awesome. Yeah. I said to him the other day, what would you say your title is? He said, composer. Mm. <laughs> yeah. And he goes off and judges competitions and things. Oh, that's brilliant. It does all these epic... So much money in computer games. Yeah. It's amazing. So what sort of music do you produce? Um, I do electronic music, oh, so yeah. some of it's a little bit computer gamey, but it's kind of a... I call it aquatic EDM, mm. like electronic dance music, so kind of between... You know, do you know Café Del Mar? Yeah. Like Ibiza, it's kind of that chill out, sort oh, of right. sunset. Mm. <laughs> sunset chill out music. Some of it's more dancey and some of it's just a bit kooky, so. So a woman of many talents, eh? <laughs> I try. <laughs> There's a the pressure here for yeah, you. Yeah, it's fine. How's that a feeling in there? So I look at the... It's pain relieving this move. Day to day, it doesn't really give me much trouble, that shoulder, but when I have any treatment on it, it always feels much more tender. Oh, yeah. I think your body hides stuff from you. Yeah. It's a very secret shoulder, I think. A <laughs> secret shoulder. Yeah. Yeah, it's funny, I was giving a girl on Wednesday an arm treatment, and it was halfway through one arm, and she had now, she said, does a lot of swimming. She's like, oh, I had no idea. She's like, oh, I've got another arm. She's a bit upset. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm afraid you do. Okay, so you might just have a look at Terrace Major, Terrace Minor. Yeah. Serratus anterior. This is the lats coming up. Mm, that's a little bit tender, that one. Is it? Yeah, mm, that's a little bit too sore, yeah, there's a few knots there. Mm. Yeah, definitely tender to the touch. Yeah. Just in it's there. often yeah, exactly a there. forgotten yeah. area. Well done. <laughs> <laughs> so what you could do is you could raise the arm that way. Mm -hmm. And then sweep up. Yeah. And then gonna, can I raise your shoulder yeah. up? If you tuck your hand under your uh, the little pillow. That's, That's great. Thank you. Okay. So you can come up under there, you've got Terrace Minor, Terrace Major, Tissimus Dorsey coming up and around. If you yeah, hook, okay. I was like, I don't if you off. hook underneath the scapula, yeah. you've got a little bit of subscapularis, oh. <laughs> sorry. Yeah. Okay. Yes, that was right on where it is. Is <laughs> that okay in there? Yeah, it's okay. You can yeah, just you can feel, the... feel it underneath. Oh, that's that point there. Yeah. Is that all right? Mm, a little bit tender, but... Too much? Yeah, tiny bit. That's... Is that better? Yeah. Yeah, it can be a neglected area. It's not really something you try and massage yourself, is it? I no. <laughs> Go over the top of the shoulder, but not kind of under the arm <laughs> to the back.
probably don't want too much pressure on here, do you? No, no, that's quite painful. So, yeah. well, it's a sort of stabby pain. It's sort of odd. Is that better? Mm -hmm. That's okay for now, though. Yeah, pressure. oh, yeah, yeah. And then I'm going to focus on the rhomboids because they're the workers at the back. Just a true point here. Yeah, yeah do, yeah. Okay, take a deep breath in. Slowly out. Is that alright? That's fine. A bit here. Out of ten? Yeah, that's okay. about six. A little bit? A little bit. Oh, there, there we are now. Yes. Yeah. Take a deep breath in and out. Going How much there. is that one? Mm, about seven. About a seven, okay. Mm. Is it coming down at all or not? Uh, a little bit. Another point? Yeah, 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 yeah. it is. Deep breath in. Let me know when it's gone, if it goes at all. Yeah, it's pretty much gone. Yeah. How's that for you? That's, that's quite painful. Right there. Mm -hmm. Seven. Yeah. Breathe in. And out. Yeah, that's going off. Is that gone now? Nearly? Yep, nearly. Yep. It's just sort of relaxes, isn't it? It does, yeah. It's really funny. Yeah, it's very... Is it coming down, yeah? Right in there. Yep. Deep breath in. Yeah, it's gone. Mm -hmm. There you are. Nice deep breath in. Yep. Yeah. How's that feeling? How about this yep. one? I still feel it, but it's mm -hmm. gone. Anything here? There, there will be, uh, yes. That. There? There. There. Okay. Yes, it's going Breathe in. Off. And out. Yeah, it's great. It's quite sharp. It's strange how you is say keep, keep breathing. It is very tempting to stop breathing. Yeah, then you suddenly realise you can't have to move for a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay, you can breathe. Because you, you've got tension, you have to yeah. hold your breath. And you don't. I think if it's, something's hurting, you often sort of hold your breath. Yeah, yeah. it's easy. And actually, deep breathing though, you know, you can breathe through pain. Yeah. And you can, if you can breathe through it and relax into it, it does reduce it. Yeah. And also when you breathe in, it kind of adds a little bit more pressure to it sometimes, isn't it? What about there? So you're going through that one? There. That one? Mm, yeah, there. Okay, breathe in. So you're going through the... And out. Uh, one voice now. Yeah, so yeah. just done... I haven't done the this one yet. Oh, no. Uh, super spinatus. Super spinatus. We'll come up to that one. Yeah, okay. To bring your arm back down, mm -hmm. thank you. Yeah, yeah it's going. Is it going at all? Yeah, it's, it's pretty much yeah. gone. Oh, a big sort of crunch in the middle yeah, of there. Yeah, there was. So I might practice that soft tissue release that we talked about before. Yeah. So bringing the arm out. It's an adductor, an abductor, sorry. Can I bring this? And then we're coming out just slightly from the supraspinatus, locking in, and taking it off, off and out. Okay. Lock in and back. Lock in and back. Lock in and back. In and back. Lock in and back. Might do it again, it's a bit tighter this one, isn't it? So it doesn't feel as bad as the other one. 